Surprise your time somewhat, Ted. Uh, I must things to do myself. What's it all about, Ted? <laughs> right. All this. Uh, well, the way I look at it, sir, is you're born, and uh, when your number's up, you're gone. And uh, anything between, well, that's a bonus, isn't it, sir? <laughs> <laughs> but it's so much better than I ever could, Ted. Listen, Ted. I'm just rattling around in the big house up there all by myself. Um, when you're done here, w why not um, pop up for a glass of sherry? I don't think so, sir. <laughs> no. No, perhaps not. Um, you've probably got to get back to Mrs. Ted. Put me tea on now, sir. Bloody good woman, Mrs. Ted. Bloody good. You're... You're really so lucky to have someone like Mrs. Ted. Very so lucky. I, um... Well, perhaps I'll see you in the pub later. You introduce me to some of your friends. Perhaps. Maybe so. Well, what about it, Ted? Think the old girl's had her day? Oh, no, she'll be fine for a while yet. Just needs a little bit of tinkering. Take a look at this here now. Look at your hands, Ted. They're all... dirty. <laughs> well, we must be getting back to work, sir. Yes, sir. Let's carry on, Ted. Ted, I... Sorry, oh, don't stand up. Um, there's something I want to talk to you about, Ted. Uh, it's the... It's... It's the greenhouse, Ted. Now, I remember asking you yesterday evening to check on the heating as we were in for a particularly cold night and you know how delicate those flowers are and the trouble I have with them and I did ask and I went in there this morning and it was cold as a refrigerator there was frost on the windows and uh, you know how much those flowers mean to me it's not as if I didn't ask and um, quite frankly I'm very I'm very I mean it's not the expense of replacing them or the time and effort that's gone into growing them. It's the fact that I specifically asked you to do something and it was your responsibility. Well, obviously, ultimately, it's my responsibility. I'm not saying uh, they are my flowers and um, I really should have checked myself. Um, you have a thousand and one things to be doing about the place and uh, I cannot expect you to, to do things which are my responsibility. And... Um, <laughs> As I say, I should have checked, and uh, I, probably I forgot to ask you. And uh, I really am very sorry, Ted. Uh, <laughs> I promise you it shan't happen again. Uh, um, I'm sorry. Ted, um, I see you've got the, the barbed wire. I think that should be everything. Uh, how about um, a bite to eat before we head for home? 
Maybe a sandwich over there, sir. No, no, I don't think so. You know, I think there's rather a nice place uh, down this way. Yes. Come on, Ted. Yes, well, isn't it, Ted? Uh, I don't normally come to this kind of place, sir. No? Well, uh, no. Um, ah! Champignon farci. You haven't lived until you've had uh, uh, champignon farci, Ted. <laughs> no, sir. You'll certainly be having them. Uh, what about you? I like that too, sir. Oh, you must have uh, whatever you like, Ted. <clears throat> the uh, 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 cocotte à l'oiselle uh, are supposed to be particularly good here, for instance. But I love that then, sir. <laughs> uh, have whatever you want, Ted. Anything. Um, as yet to pêcheur, for example. Uh, you like fish. Um, it's a, it's a, a selection of, of seafood poached in a, in a, a court bouillon. With but I love that, then, sir. Yes, very well. It's a good choice, Ted. Ah, the wine. I don't think so, sir. I've got a lot to do this afternoon, there's the... The drainage in the lower field and uh, one of the stable doors needs to be The Yes, the, the stable doors, yes. Well, uh, just one glass then. I, I don't think so, sir. Of oh, course. No, thank you, sir. One glass and the devil with the stable doors. <laughs> uh, are you ready to order? Uh, yes, I think so. Um, Ted? Um. Right, uh, I'll have the, um, the, 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 I got better burned excited. Uh, uh, good go on, Ted. Got burned in a fire, sir. A fire? Like you've led. <laughs> I don't really like to talk about it, sir. Happened when I was a very young man. I just started a new job at the big house. When it caught fire, sir, oh, it was terrible, sir. A terrible confusion, people running about. Well, they all got out. But then the nursemaid said, that she'd left a little child, a baby boy he was, in the nursery. So, with no thought to my own personal safety, so I dashed into the building and fought me up the stairs.